graduate class to the graduate class of 2023, I extend my heartfelt congratulations to you, Rural Transformation Specialists. I want to underline that statement, Rural Transformation Specialists. Because as we talk now, our graduates from African Union University who underwent incubation by working at the sub counties since 2012 were deployed in 2021 to 20 districts of meat western and central western uganda 20 districts and they are working with the young people under the ambit of uh, uganda road development and training institute by last count in two years of service at the district level they have graduated 40 thousand young men and women in various skills, in various sectors, and more than 80% is trusting to dignified job, and all our graduates have undergone what we call directorate of industrial institute assessment. That's not a job. So when we talk about rural transformation, we really mean business. So we congratulate you, and I want to say that the path you have walked is not just one of academic rigor, but also a journey that has required resilience, determination, and a deep connection to the communities. I remember people used to ask us and our students, because the vision of African Rural University has always been the empowerment of individuals who armed with knowledge and a sense of purpose can bring about positive change in their lives and that of their communities. Today, as we witness the fruition of that vision in the form of our graduates, I'm filled with hope of the future. To put this in context, allow me, Mr. Chancellor, and our guest of honor to share some impactful numbers that highlight the tangible difference our students graduating have made in the community already. Ours do not wait until they graduate. As change makers and change agents, they start onset upon joining our university. Sir Chancellor, they have managed to enable 2,800 community members to come up with what we call community action plans. They have reached 5,000. These who are graduating, not everybody. They have reached 5,000 individuals and oriented them into visionary approach to development, human and community. Using the human rights approach to programming, they have reached 5,000 people who know their rights, but also the duty bearers know their responsibilities. Mr. Chairman, Mr. Chancellor, sir, the graduates have conducted 
research, participatory action research for only six projects and the results are available. So therefore, we are proud also to say that in our internship program, our graduates now who are going to be graduates in a few minutes managed to reach 10,000 people in the areas of Kakumiro, Kibale, and Kagadi. To their graduates, you are not just receiving a degree, you are inheriting a responsibility of change making. And it is very important that you are doing that when we are mourning an icon in the women's empowerment and the struggle for justice and for women emancipation, Honorable, Sarah, uh, Honorable Joyce Impanga. And of course, not forgetting a contemporary Dr. Sarah Antiro, who were champions of uh, women's movement from the colonial days. So you have now to hold the torch and you have to keep the candle burning. 